Hey guys, welcome to fourth grade, chapter two, lesson three. You guys are going to love this. Okay, so we are going to multiply by tens, hundreds, and thousands. Okay, these are wonderful because we're going to start with number two. Number one's already done for you as usual. Okay, we need to do nine times six, okay, which is 54. And then we're going to add that zero on 540. Okay, eight times two is 16. And then we're going to add those two zeros on. 1600. Okay. The ones that have a number that ends in zero, like five times six is 30. Don't let this zero trip you up. You still have to add three more zeros for what's in the problem. 30,000. Okay. So you guys are going to do five through 14. You totally can. Watch out for number 13. Don't you let that extra zero trip you up like in number four, okay? You guys keep an eye out for that. All right. So number 15 says a bank teller has seven rolls of coins. Each roll has 40 coins. How many coins? So we have 40 times seven. So I'm going to do four times seven is 28. And then I'm going to add that extra zero on. And don't forget the label, okay? All right. Theo buys five packages of paper. There are 500 sheets in, of paper in each package. How many sheets of paper does Theo buy? Well, five times five is 25, and then I'm gonna add on my two zeros. 25 sheets. You can write sheets of paper if you want to. Save time, I'm not going to. Okay, all right. You guys are going to do the lesson check on the back. I believe in you, okay? Then we are gonna go down and we're gonna do the style review. It is important. We are going to write a comparison sentence to represent this equation. So to write a comparison sentence, we could write 42 divided by six equals seven. We could write 42 divided by seven equals six. Or we could even write, Seven times six equals 42. If you're an overachiever, you can write all three, okay? All right, the population of Middleton is 6,054 6, people. Write this number in standard form. Well, all that means is to write it in numbers, okay? Standard form is just numbers. So 6,000, okay, 1,000, do you see that little comma there? That means a comma here, okay? 54 people. Well, we're going to have to have three numbers here, okay? Fill in a zero for the hundreds place. It says 54. There's no hundreds there. So fill in a zero for those hundreds people, okay? So word problem, word answer, okay? Right people. All right. An election for mayor, 85,034 people voted for Carl Green and 67,952 people voted for Maria Lewis. How many votes did Carl Green win the election by? So we need to take the amount that is larger and subtract the amount. And then we'll know the difference. We'll find the difference by subtracting. Okay? Four minus two. Two. Three take away five. I can't. And I can't borrow from zero. So I have to go all the way over to this five and make it a four, that's 10. Now I need to borrow one, making that a nine and that 13. Now 13 take away five is eight, nine take away nine is zero, four take away seven I cannot do. So I have to come over to the eight, borrow one making it seven and the four becomes a 14. 14 take away seven is seven, seven take away six is one. So 17,082 votes says how many votes? Votes. Don't forget to label. Okay. All right, guys. Last one. Meredith picked four times as many green peppers as red peppers. So remember green, red. Okay. All right. Red peppers. Green peppers was four times as many. Okay. So she picked a total of 20 peppers. How many peppers did she pick? Well, we're taking that 20 
and we are dividing it by one, two, three, four, five boxes. And we know that five times four is 20. So this would be four. Oh, sorry. That makes each one of these boxes worth four. My bad. Okay, so that's true. Okay, but that's not the answer. Okay, we're on there on accident. Okay, so it says how many green peppers did you pick? Well, this is the green peppers. So there's four boxes and there's four in each box and four times four is 16. 16 green peppers. Okay, there you go, guys. All right. Thank you for hanging out for 2.3. Come on back for 2.4. See you guys soon.